I thought I'd do a quick discussion on primers. Now priming in general is debated and which primer is best is totally subjective. What one person hates the next loves. The best thing to do is to try things out for yourself and find what works for your style of painting or the projects you do. But here's my list. Tester's primer. For very basic priming needs this worked fine. Most miniature priming, not Reaper Bones though, this worked just fine. It isn't flashy and in my experience it also isn't great, but priming doesn't have to be brilliant, it just has to do the job. The biggest benefit of this primer is the price. Several places where it is available often have discounts and cans can be got for around $5, so at a pinch it's fine. Tamiya. Tamiya is one of the better spray primers I used. It goes on nice and smooth and gives a great finish. I used it on minis and kits and never had a problem. Its big drawback is its small can and can cost around $12.95, which makes it expensive. Steinal Res. Now this is the new talked about primer. I haven't used it yet, but have seen it used by a guy I respect greatly. George in Scotland. He likes it very much and it has given him good results. I bought some on his recommendation, but I don't like it. For me, it suffers from the same problem that Tamiya one does. It's good, but it's expensive, which means I won't want to use it on anything other than my best projects, which means I will need a second primer for armies or lesser projects. I want one general purpose primer that I can use on everything. And for me, I found one. Army Painter. For me, this is my personal favourite. It comes in a big can, sells for $12.95 compared to $19.95 for GW White, sprays beautifully, works on everything we have tried including Reaper Bones which can be a bit fickle with primers, goes on misty and smooth and I have used it as an actual white as well as a primer. Looks great on Stormtroopers. We have had it six months, used it a lot and it's still going strong. It's been great to use, great value for money. One other great thing is it comes in a bunch of other colours, red, blue, grey, etc. But the colours are $16.95. Not sure why that is, and that does suck a bit, Army Painter. But for the white and black, Army Painter is my go-to primer. Please tell me that was good. <laughs>